I should be able to walk down the street and, and the way that I walk and it shouldn't be a problem to anyone. But I can tell you it certainly is. When Gary Endicott was born with cerebral palsy, his parents were told he would never walk. 45 years on, he's run the New York Marathon four times and climbed Mount Kilimanjaro. You get what you settle for and, and um, you know, I didn't want everyone to feel sorry for me. It would be nice to get a bit more understanding at times, but I wanted to actually ha have a good life. Gary's a keen sportsman, a husband and father to two boys. He's also the Ministry of Education's only disability facilitator, working with disabled children and their families. What I love about my job is it can be life changing. If I do my job right, then I can create the environments where people get the changes that they want. Because there's plenty of people out there with disabilities and their families that know where they want to be, but unfortunately not too many of them know how to get there. He's really great to work with. Um, and yes, the, he does tell it as it is. <laughs> but he certainly tells them that, okay, well you need to be doing this um, to improve whatever it happens to be, whether it's their muscles or, or their attitude or their independence. He does care a lot for um, you and he knows how you feel because he's been through the same path as me, but in a way that he is really to the boundary. He is the drill sergeant. He is the boot camp. I do a lot of work with families. It can be quite hard at times. And unfortunately, families have to fight for a lot more things than what they should have to. There's just too many unnecessary obstacles in front of them. It's re really important that you concentrate, all right? I'm really pleased with where, where I'm at now and if somebody had said that I'd be trucking along as well as I have now, there's lots of reasons for that. I've had good people around me and um, I've made the most of that.